Then we put that in the light. And that's that's real gold. Yeah. You know, what's what's life all about? You know, you can work a job your whole life. And then I'm going to go. When I get retired, I'm going to go travel. I'm going to get me a camper. Yeah, right up until the day you can't walk no more. Therefore, you can't go to work. And then you're junk and you can't go do this. Mm -hmm. Do it now while you can. When you die, the big fancy house isn't going with you. No. The cars aren't going with you. No. No. I've chose at this point to do this. And I don't care about the rest of that stuff. I don't care about no big house. You can have all them big houses. I built a lot of big houses and I don't want one. Mm -hmm. I want a little cabin in the woods, a little car in the desert. It's fine with me. I sell. I <laughs> <laughs> hello. I'm Bob from Wisconsin. Mm -hmm. Back home, they call me Wisconsin Bob, and I decided to run off this winter and go find some sun somewhere. Ended up here at Lake Havasu. Got a little car. Works out good. I'm married. I've been married thirty. Ooh, hopefully she don't see this. Thirty-two or thirty-three years now. Mm -hmm. Married the same gal. My wife decided she didn't want to come. She wants to stay home and play with the grandkids, and, mm -hmm. and she's still working. I'm done working. Mm -hmm. And she enjoys her job and likes what she's doing right now in life. So, and it was, it gets below zero, 20 below when I left the house. Mm -hmm. And out here to this, this is great. So I'm just gonna kind of hang around and, until the snow melts away at home. And, <laughs> Head you, back that way. You enjoy your son here. Yes. And then your wife lets you come here. I have the most beautiful woman in the world. She just, just loves me. I love her. She lets me do what I want. She does what she wants. That's probably why our relationship has lasted as long as it has. Mm -hmm. We don't argue with each other. We just talk to each other. Mm -hmm. And I said, I want to go to Arizona for the winter. And she says, what are you going to take? And then we started looking for a little beater and found one and here I am. <laughs> I talked to her this morning and she she's all good with everything. She likes my little posts I put on the Facebook stuff and thinks it's great. So that's that's good for me. Okay. Thank you. She 300 bucks, did a little work to her. Now I put a Chinese diesel heater. Works really well. I rec mm. I recommend that. Chinese diesel heater. Keeps her nice and toasty in there. I got a mm -hmm. 100 amp hour battery, some solar, and self-contained. Does really well. I got So how many miles on it till you bought it this? Oh, it had 216,000 on I think when I bought it. Mm -hmm. And it needed brakes and it needed a fuel pump and a couple other little things and I did that and took the Just... back seats and got rid of them and I put a surface down where the seat rolled. Mm -hmm. on the floor it made a nice bed i stretch out with this with the seat forward i'm five foot eight and i can stretch mm -hmm. right out don't touch my head or my feet in the back three hundred dollars you bought it and how much you put it i more? put in about 200 before i left so i'm about five before i left mm -hmm. and then on the road i'm a little about 560 dollars in parts because i had wheel bearings and a couple other things go bad on it an axle <laughs> on that on the trip so and I fixed it all myself. And so you fixed it almost $700 and then $300. Then so about a thousand bucks. thousand bucks, yeah. For the, the, the car and the... So not, no problem. You know, what, what does a person spend on a vacation? If you run off for two weeks, you'll spend a little more than a thousand. So you are not worried about any more problems? Well... I do need an oil change. I'm going to get that next couple days here. Mm -hmm. uh, now the rest of it seems to be doing good. Real yeah. good. Now they worked all the little bugs out of it. <laughs> when I get back home, I'm getting rid of it. What does it mean? You're going to sell it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'll sell it to some young kid. Get, get seven, eight hundred uh. bucks out of it. And they'll be happy. I'll be happy. That's a, something. I found two solar panels two on, solar panels. on uh, yeah. Facebook Marketplace in Phoenix, Arizona. Uh -huh. 
and I paid thirty dollars a piece for them. Uh huh. And they're eighty-seven watt monocrystallines, and they're off a house. And then I made this. They got caulk all over it. Mm -hmm. But I made this little thing to set them in. This whole deal, and it works out slick. I ran the heater last night. I don't usually run the heater all night, mm -hmm. but I fell asleep with it on. And I woke up about three o'clock this morning and I was all sweaty and stuff because it was hot in there. So you have a car and tent. Where do you sleep then? I sleep in the car. I'll show you. Okay. I sit here. Uh huh. I kick off my boots, pull my socks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And look. Let me see. Wow. And then, like I say, the seat, I got it back now, mm -hmm. but it goes this much farther. And I got no problem. I sleep so comfortable in here. Yeah. I got plenty of room. Mm -hmm. Really soft. I got yeah, lots it's of. Very soft. Nice, soft, comfortable. Mm -hmm. I have right over here. Let me step back out of here. Put my boot on. Nice boots, yep, by the way. You. That's what my doctor told me, too. <laughs> And if you look over there, I have a little camp stove. Mm -hmm. I make my coffee and yeah. And then that rope. Yeah, what's that for? That keeps my blanket for laying on the heater and plugging it off. And here's is my. Tank. It's a diesel fuel diesel for my fuel? my Chinese diesel heater. Oh, where's the heater? Can the I heater see? is buried. It's in the back of the car in here buried underneath stuff but I got like the mufflers right here uh-huh and it's got a muffler yeah and stuff here mm -hmm. and then the air comes in from the bumper I shoved the air uh -huh. intake up in there and that's it's working good and this uh, is my fuel line fuel line yeah and then the fuel pump is over there mm -hmm. even though you turn on the heater inside but no worry to film get none none None, absolutely none. It's just a heat exchanger. Mm -hmm. The combustion layer comes from outside mm -hmm. and exits outside. Wow. It just heats up that little unit and then the air blows past it, heats okay. it, it gets hot. The heat comes out right here, okay? Uh -huh. Right out of these two holes. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. It's firing up right now, but in a minute, uh -huh. it's just starting. In okay. a minute, it's gonna get so hot you almost can't touch it. Okay. I got it so hot in there, it was like a sauna. And then my wife, she's real concerned about me, you mm -hmm. know, asphyxiating myself or whatnot. And mm -hmm. we checked it and I put a carbon monoxide tester in there and stuff from the house. I didn't bring one with. So what kind of camping stuff do you have? This, this I shower with. Shower. I open the hatch up and I got a hammock mm -hmm. that I hang around it and I can shower right here standing at the back of the car. Okay. And I made these things. Uh -huh. These are just some foam boards at, at oh, Walmart. Wow. This nice. And then I cut them to fit. Cut it to fit the window. Uh -huh. And then. So you can get a privacy inside. Yeah. So, and then people. It was a little too short. People cannot you. see. Yeah, it works. Uh -huh. You can't see in there at all. Yeah, all dark. It works good. Yeah. And then it's fast. Take it right out of there. Yeah. And then I got. For the front window and what my wife did is we put velcro on it the velcro sticks to the headliner see that uh -huh. anywhere i put this thing mm -hmm. the velcro it sticks see awesome because i can yeah. put it anywhere i want it's cool i have yeah and then this yeah. table is out of a PT Cruiser, a different car. Mm -hmm. And I made it to where I can take these pins, pull these pins out. Mm -hmm. Anyways, they come out both sides and I can take this, mm -hmm. move it out to here, put these pins back. Mm -hmm. And before I put this, this drawer slide in here, well, I just did that yesterday. Mm. Look at what I did here. This is, this is my groceries. Yeah. And then, 
I built this thing yesterday. <laughs> so, awesome. So I can wow. still still get under here and sleep. Because uh -huh. sometimes I sleep at the truck stop if I'm you know going from one place to the other. Mm-hmm. And I need to do it quick. I don't want to have to take everything apart. Wow. And see, I can still so get under cool. here and Isn't sleep. It? Yeah. And then I was thinking as I was using it, if we look at the other end, now I got more table. <laughs> yeah. I can sit right here, got this and uh -huh. this. I don't yeah. know, this was just an afterthought. You can use it multiple. You oh, made no. these things all on the road. Yes, I did everything on the road. I... Uh oh, yeah. look at there. <laughs> okay. There. See, don't stay on me. And what's that? That's to help me quit smoking. Okay. That's one of them mm -hmm. patches or whatever. Mm -hmm. They work, it seems like. Okay. Now, the tent, I brought it along not to sleep in it. That was not my intentions. Mm -hmm. That was just for storage. Uh -huh. So, when I stop here, I can get all the junk out of the car and I can be comfortable for a few days, you know. Although, yeah. I'm finding that this is very comfortable already. Yeah. I just had too much stuff. So when you go camping, when you get there, then you set up the tent and then all the storage stuff to goes in there. Yep. Yeah. And then I'm trying to configure it now, okay. like with this little drawer thing, which is just just testing, just prototype. I don't mm -hmm. uh mm. to where I can get in the back, sleep, cook mm -hmm. without taking everything out of there. Okay. And it's getting way better already. Mm. This drawer did a big deal. Uh, the solar panel stuff. The first couple weeks I was driving around to help charge a battery up. Mm -hmm. So I didn't stay in one spot, but overnight. And now I've been here a few days and yeah, it's gonna work. So you like it? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I love it. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and what, what makes it easier to do this mm -hmm is when you have support from family and friends. Mm -hmm. My wife, my kids, even my buddies, they come over, oh wow, you know, I wish we was going with and this and that, you know, and I told them, get in, let's go. Mm -hmm. And they didn't, they couldn't, so. So you, you came alone. Gotta go mm -hmm. by myself, gotta go. Mm -hmm. The winters in Wisconsin where we live are so cold and brutal. Mm -hmm. it, it hurts my fingers and my back and everything else. and. Let's go spend some time in the desert. You retire? Yes and no. Mm -hmm. uh, I do construction work and I got kind of busted up motorcycle wrecks and being dumb when I was a kid and I hurt. I'm 54. I saved some money. We sold our house. Uh, my wife is still working and she, she sees me every day fighting the cold at home. She told me, get out of here, go where it's warm for the winter. Mm -hmm. So here I am, Lake Havasu City, Arizona. You have a nice, beautiful wife. She is yeah. super people. Mm -hmm. I am so lucky, so blessed. I have other friends that have been married as long as I have, and they don't get along nowhere near like, they can't mm -hmm. even go to the bar by themselves without getting in trouble or, you know, the wife yelling at them. And, my wife don't yell at me, lets me do what I want. We discuss everything. She helped me with this car. Mm. I'll, I'm coming again next year. Yeah. Next year I'm gonna have a big camper and yeah. it'll be different next year. Yeah. This so, is this is okay. Mm -hmm. And I'm 100% comfortable. Mm -hmm. uh, the bathroom stuff, I got it buckets and bags and we do it that, that's the shower. Yeah. Baby wipes are your friend. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, of course. And that spray bottle works real nice. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, it's all good. Really yeah. good. And I still talk to my wife and my kids every day. My kids talk to me three or four times a day. Sometimes I shut my phone off just so I could take a minute. <laughs> and they love me. want to know how it's going and send pictures. Mm -hmm. And they're just all so mm -hmm. happy that I can do this. And I'm yeah. happy because they let me do this. Mm -hmm. You know, I, I thanked my son the other day. I says, John, thank you. He says, for what? I said, for help me out and let me do this Arizona thing. He said, I didn't do nothing. You did everything. It's your deal. But yeah. he helped with the car. You know, he helped me install the heater and we took the back seats out and we put brakes on it and did a bunch of other things to it. And he helped me every minute he had, he was helping me with this. You have a good son.
Yes, very yeah. good. I have. Yeah. This, I am so blessed with my children. It's. It's. I have three children, seven grandchildren, and hopefully by the time I get home, I'll have number eight grandchild. And I'm going gold panning too. I found some gold already. Gold pan. Gold pan. Gold classifier for to uh -huh. get the bigger rocks out of it. Uh -huh. And this here, I bought this for the smaller rocks. It don't work too good. Mm -hmm. In here. Is there a gold? Yes. But this is in the sand and you really can't see it in there. Uh -huh. But it's in there. Then we put that in the light. And that's, that's real gold. Yeah. And that was one day, well, actually about two hours worth or so. And that was in the Prescott National Forest on uh, uh, Lynx Creek in the Prescott National Forest. Okay, I hope you find big, oh. big rock gold nugget. Size yeah. of Easter eggs is what I want. Yeah. <laughs> Like a ostrich egg. Yeah, yeah big one. <laughs> yeah. I hope you find it. Oh, I do. Uh, I, I really want to. Yeah. I think it would be so much fun. Yeah. And I'm not... I don't care if I make any money. I don't, I don't even expect to make any money. I don't even... Yeah. Even if I find a whole bucket of gold, I'm not going to sell it. I'm going to take yeah. it home and we're going to play with it. Just to fun. Something yeah, to fun. do. Yeah. You know, I've had hobbies. Working on hot rods, we built a few of them, and they were fun. Uh, I ride a lot of motorcycle. I ride a Triumph made in England motorcycle. Mm -hmm. uh, we do a lot of that, and we fish, we hunt. Mm -hmm. But I wanted to always try the gold pan and stuff. <laughs> Go see if I could do it. Yeah. And then I, it's a lot of work. Yeah. Yeah. You got to move a lot of rocks. Yeah. The only reason I'm keeping this, there's probably two or three pennies worth of gold in there that's it mm. and then there's gold in there mm -hmm. it's just super fine so he said keep all that stuff and then someday you just run that whole bucket full of stuff and you'll get a bunch of gold out of it i'm like okay we'll try it see what happens yeah what's the worst happen no gold <laughs> i spent my whole life out no gold <laughs> well a shovel too so you already had a goal, your wife and your son and your daughter. I've already got all the gold that I want. Mm -hmm. I don't need any more. As far as if you look at it, I have a lovely wife, lovely kids. It all working for us. I ain't saying it's all perfect. Sometimes I have to go over there and chew some butt, but it all works out, you know. My kids love me and they let me... I can't say enough good about them. They're just, they're cool. I like it. Lovely, and it's 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 a blessing to be able to do this. I, but I've always just done kind of what I want, and the wife's never had a problem with it. It's always been when I went to work. I never worry about the money. She does all that. I don't even know what we pay in electricity. Mm -hmm. I don't know what we spend on groceries. She takes care of all that stuff. Mm -hmm. I go to work, I get a paycheck, I put it in a bank. Mm -hmm. uh, if I want to buy something, I ask the wife. I say, hey, can I buy this? And she'll say, yeah. Uh, you know? And if money's short or whatever, she'll mm -hmm. say, well, can you wait? Can you hold off? Mm -hmm. Yeah, whatever. It all works. No arguing, no fighting. Mm -hmm. You know, it's all that's good. good. Yeah. And that's what I really like. Okay. Bob, I really appreciate you taking the time and show me everything and then sharing your story. Yeah. I hope you your life is beautiful, wonderful and awesome. Be happy forever. Yes, be that's happy what it's forever. about. Well, I put this lump in it. I got it hot and then bent it. That's to keep the rocks from hurting something.
Thomas Cons, look me up. Okay. Go fishing, do something good. Good. Sounds good. Waterfalls. Sounds good. Thank you. Safe trip. Oh, I'm Oh, come sir, come sir. I'm Hey, hey. Ara, ara, ara. Oh, I'm Come sir. Oh, my son is going to Hey, hey. Aha. Arasa, arasa, arasa. Oh, keep it by the neon or then. Ah! Oh, pfft! Come, Saba! Video chicken take a need a chicken. Oh, come, Saba! Where is it? Catch two chillers, sir. Ow! What's up, Zua? Two chillers, sir, two. Chris, come on, Saba. Ah! Oh! Keep skidding, man. Don't worry, I'll pull you up.